everyone welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here hi my name is Ritana and I hope you subscribe today's recipe is um, for lamb it's called orog it's basically like a, a vegetable patty and it's so delicious and easy to make I'm gonna read one thing from the Bible what a story that um, I'm gonna be reading and it's when Jesus was in the desert for 40 days and when the devil was trying to tempt him and um let's see what it says about that so i'm reading luke chapter three to four and this one is chapter four so when he was leaving the jordan river the holy spirit led him to the desert and he stayed there for 40 days and the devil was tempting him of course like we said and the devil said to him if you are the son of god tell the stone to become bread so Jesus answered and said, It is written, Man must not live only on bread. And the devil said to him, He tempted him in another way. And he said, Then the devil led Jesus up to a high place. In an instant, he showed Jesus all the kingdoms of the world. He said to Jesus, I will give you all their authority and glory. It has been given to me. I can give it to anyone i want if you worship me it will be all yours so jesus answered it is written worship the lord your god he is the only one you should serve and then the devil said then the devil led jesus to a jerusalem he had jesus sent on the highest mountain of the temple if you are the son of God, he said, throw yourself down from here. It, it, it is written, the Lord will command his angels to take good care of you. They will lift you up in, the, in their hand. Then you won't trip over a stone. And then Jesus answered, scripture says, do not test the Lord your God. When the devil finished all his temptation, he left Jesus until a better time. So, the the like story behind this is the devil can keep trying with you and like keep tempting you. But if you stand your ground and you don't listen to him, then um, he will leave you alone, you know? So, the way Jesus... Um, like kind of fought you know the devil was by using scripture to kind of like back him off you know and yeah so let's go and do the recipe i know it was a long intro sorry about that but it's important to know this stuff so yeah let's go into the recipe for this recipe you will need some vegetables and flour of course and some seasoning these are my preferred um, vegetables and seasoning. You can use whatever you want. So I'm gonna put cauliflower and garlic, onion, potato, tomato, and squash or zucchini, and asparagus. You can also put um, parsley, spinach. I have spinach, but I have to wash it. Anyways, and the seasoning, I have um, curry, um, smoked paprika or sweet paprika, um, onion powder, garlic powder, and vegetable seasoning um, instead of salt. If you don't have it, just use salt and um, seven spices. And I also have flour.
so we have to get our hand messy with this recipe but yeah they look so delicious and crunchy mm. they are really delicious you can add more spiciness if you want but yeah they are so delicious and you can make like a batch and then just store it like i did so yeah with that being said i'll see you guys next time and i hope you guys like the recipe